All roads lead home, or in this case, lanes. A decorated swimmer at the University of Toledo is returning for the Rockets. J.C. Dyer was introduced today as the new head coach for women's swimming and diving. As Toledo's first max swimmer of the year, Dyer is one of the most decorated athletes in Toledo's history. The four-time All-Max selection and Hall of Famer spent the past two seasons as the head coach at Fairfield University, leading the Stags to success. Now at her alma mater, Dyer plans to do the same for the Rockets. Words cannot express how surreal this is for me right now, um, being back at my alma mater and being back at a place that helped me become who I am today. It's just, it's such a cool experience. Our team has always performed well academically. Um, tremendous young ladies outside the pool. Um, this search was really, how can we find that individual to lead us to higher heights? I learned that this was one of the most coveted mid-major jobs in the country. I learned that the MAC is one of the top swimming conferences in all of mid-major athletics. The other thing I found out is we had a record-setting Hall of Fame swimmer that was a current head coach at Fairfield. And as I talked to individuals, hey, hey, do you know about J.C. Dyer? Have you, have you talked to her? Do you know about her past and the history? And the more you dive into that and you see a Hall of Famer who set a ton of records, a 2010 um, top MAC swimmer of the year, um, a four-time uh, all-MAC performer, and, and a record setter here. And then you say, by the way, she's also a sitting Division I head coach. And by the way, she just won a conference tournament uh, with the team that she's at. And so then it was on the pursuit to try to figure out if we could land this deal um, and get her back home. Um, and, and I'm excited to say that we did. Press conferences don't happen for swim coaches. So I just want to take this time to thank Brian Blair for like letting like Olympic sport coaches to experience this and to enjoy this moment. When you get a text from Jason Candle, a Division I football coach, and Todd Kowalczyk, the you know, Division I men's basketball coach, um, it's, it's a big deal and you feel just just so unique and just so welcomed and part of a family already before even setting foot on campus. And it's one thing to say, to ask someone to buy into something, but when you kind of have the stats to back it up, it's another thing and, and just gives us a whole nother level of trust in her that she knows what it takes to compete at this level and she knows what we need to do to be able to compete at this level. Um, and I think that it, it's just huge knowing that she has that faith in us um, and I think that it's it's a buy-in process, you know, and if, if she's asking me to buy into something that won her a MAC championship, then I'm going to buy into it, you know, no questions asked.